the five animal freedoms are globally recognized as the gold standard in animal welfare. They encompass the mental and physical well-being of an animal. Taking these five freedoms and applying species-specific knowledge to them will provide excellent care for any animal. If any of these freedoms cannot be met consistently, the animal will suffer. It is important to carefully consider these freedoms during research prior to owning any animal to ensure it fits with your environment. I am not an animal or tortoise expert. Freedom from hunger and thirst by ready access to fresh water and diet to maintain health and vigor. This simply means that Claudio always has access to fresh water and food and he eats vet recommended grass pellets and a variety of other live plants which are always available along with fresh water for drinking and bathing. Freedom from discomfort by providing an appropriate environment including shelter and a comfortable resting place. Claudio has an enclosed brick hide with great ventilation and a plant pot that he sleeps in and to get out of the rain. He has many safe places to walk, stretch, swim, and hide in peace. Freedom from pain, injury, or disease by prevention or rapid diagnosis and treatment. Claudio's enclosure is free from predators and other environmental dangers. His brick and wire walls provide all the space and safety he needs. Sometimes injury or disease is unavoidable, so I know where the closest reptile vet is if needed, and I do anything in my power to help Claudio be pain, injury, and disease free. Freedom to express normal behavior by providing sufficient space, proper facilities, and company of the animal's own kind. This freedom requires specific knowledge of leopard tortoises. Claudio needs sunlight to be healthy, so his enclosure is outside. Being from Africa, the heat does not bother him at all, but he will need external heat during the winter. His enclosure is filled with natural and edible materials, even some plants native to his homelands. He has multiple places to lounge or hide. Claudio's enclosure allows him to behave as he would in nature, and being a tortoise, he is naturally and happily solitary. Freedom from fear and distress by ensuring conditions and treatment which avoid mental suffering. I try not to bother Claudio unless he is out and about. I make sure every day that his area is clean and that there are no causes of distress. I try to research and deduce what he likes and dislikes and I try to do those things and to try to treat him as a genuine friend. 